guys, it's Nick Sir. Are you ready? And welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you guys are new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button below. Turn on the notification by hitting that bell. Give me your thumbs up. And if you guys have anything to say, questions, comments, prayer requests, it don't matter. Please go ahead and leave your comments below. And I'll be more than happy to read from it and get back with you as quickly as I can. So you guys ready for video number 58? Alright, so today... I'm at another place. I'm at I'm at the Springs Church right now for young adults uh, reach. So, um, so today I'm going to be talking about loving others. And many people are wondering why are we, why am I talking about loving others? Well, before we get to that, just join me in prayer. Let's go to our Lord. So, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I pray that that uh, you give me the strength so I can let people know how to love others and how to love for themselves and so just like your son Jesus Christ loved the church and I thank you Father for everything you've done Lord I love you from the bottom of my heart in Jesus name I praise thank you amen okay so again I'm going to talk about loving others so what does that mean loving others well because loving others is very important in life right if it's mom dad brother sister friend uncle aunt it don't it don't matter who it is you know we are a family it's not just you have a family your own family but also families as well and you know what god is good all the time and you know just like christ loved the church so loving others is amazing it's a very amazing thing especially you loving your your spouse or your girlfriend you know what I mean? So, to love others, you have to treat others with respect, courtesy, uh, friendly, all that good stuff. So, when you love someone, is it's from the bottom of your heart. It's from the kindness of your heart. And, you know, it doesn't matter who it is, like who you run to or something. You got to love on somebody. This is part of being a better person. This is part of being a man and woman of God. And so, you know, you got to love everybody. It doesn't matter what it is. It doesn't matter what color it is. It doesn't matter what gender and disability and stuff like that. That is part of being a better person to love others. Loving is a very amazing thing when you love someone. So... And you know, love can mean anything. L O V E. <laughs> so, yeah, so, um, you know, your favorite food, your favorite movie, you, your favorite television show, your favorite, it doesn't matter what your favorite, like, your favorite stuff is your loving, your, your stuff. Can be anything. It's not just people, but also, products and food and stuff you know what you know God is watching you God will understand what you love about what you love about God what you love about Christ as well as you love on someone as well you, you love whatever is what you love is very important in life and you gotta realize that loving someone is a beautiful thing you see what I mean loving is very important and you got to picture your mind on who you love with and you know if you're part of the church if you're part of whatever it is you gotta love on somebody you gotta say hi how you doing either give a handshake or a hug I love to give people hugs, but some people, if they don't want, if they don't want hugs, I give them a handshake or I do a fist bump. Okay, so you know, it doesn't matter who it is. It could be anybody. It could be a stranger or anybody. But you know what? If you met somebody, if you meet someone, tell them, please tell them that God is good all the time, and God is so amazing to us God made us us ourselves 
And you got to think, well, you know, God, you made me this person. All I have to do, and God made you love on somebody. Because loving arms, loving hands, loving on people is such an amazing, amazing thing. But don't hate on people. Don't let people address you as hater. You don't want that. Don't drink too much of hater rate. Drink some love potion. Love potion can make you love on people. Come on now. For people, for some people that are hating on me, well, that's bad news. I'm not going to let people to hate on me. Because I know, because reality, you cannot trust everybody. But you know what? If people say positive things about me, then I, I'm really thankful. And that means... They appreciate you. They appreciate me on who I am. And that's a very good thing. So loving people can mean anything. It can be anything you want. It can be anything you see or whatever it is. So loving on people, loving others, loving whoever, it's very powerful. What a powerful thing to love on somebody. You see what I mean? Not hating on people. That's just wrong. So, you're a good person. Just be a good person. Be a, a loving person. It can be charming. You know what? It's very amazing. It's such an amazing thing when you love on someone. So, um, you know, just like Christ loved the church. You know, it's in Christ's blood that he shed for us and he died for us and that he rose again for us and so therefore loving people you know just picture that you're loving on somebody you love on one person you could you love on other person or anybody and you know love is such wonderful thing love is pretty amazing and pretty awesome to think you know what I gotta start loving on someone and that's what you have to do that's what you have to do when you get to the person make sure you live on somebody you know I got I have like over a thousand friends so far and you know, some people like me, some people don't. Well, you know what? Then some people love me the way I am. And that's why being unique is very important. A uniqueness. Just be who you are. Just be yourself and be you. That's a very good thing. So I love you guys. God bless you. And um, sorry, I, I I wasn't at my, at my house uh, in my room doing a video today because I'm in another place. I'm at Springs Church right now. So, so uh, God bless you. Love you guys. And uh, peace. Love on somebody. Okay.